Hello, my dear friends. This is Krostich with Luda. Welcome back to my channel. I've been absent for a while because we've been traveling in Asia, as you know, some of you have seen on my Instagram. So today I supposed to record another video, but in the last minute I decided to make my Krostich stash. And um, I don't know how to start this video, but I'll try to be as organized as possible because I have lots of lots of cross stitch kits. But first of all, let me tell you before I will show you all these <laughs> wonderful kits, I'll show you how I store my leftovers from Dimensions kits. I've been stitching Dimension kits from I think 2007, and uh, before I never kept my leftovers but now i do in case i want to stitch really old design and i don't have original threads because dimensions kids they don't use dmc they use special threads which they dye for their uh, for their kids and uh, I, I told you many many times kids are made in the united states for example this is very very old organizer and you can see the difference between kits made in the United States. Sometimes they're like that. Sometimes they're just plain organizer. This is newest one. <laughs> but uh, if you see organizer like that, it means kits were made in China. And if you see here the color 15, 360, could be very different from 15360 uh, from the kit made in the United States. As well, if you will compare organizer, let's say we will have same colors uh, here and there, they could be different as well. Because even DMC threads, they've been dyed in the same factory, maybe different year, they could be different colors. They cannot make uh, the same color one to one. That's why be very very careful when you replace your thread. Sometimes there can could be missing. Even if you will order at the factory of uh, from dim, uh, from dimensions, they could be different. And uh, just be extra extra careful. So this is how I store my dimensions threads. I have also lots of black colors. Also, they can be different, and I don't know how accurate you can see right now, but believe me, they're different. If you will look at them proper, uh, properly, they are. Sometimes they have lots of other threads on this kind of organizer because they can't fit in a Chinese organizer like that one. So they give you extra threads. So I make them like that. It's pretty and it's organized and it's really comfortable for me to store them. I still have a lot of mess here, but I will work on it when I have time because now we're going away again. So basically I won't be here for the whole summer and it's end of June anyway. Another box I have, actually I got these boxes from Home Goods. <laughs> it's my favorite store <laughs> because I always shop there. I always like something there. And some of my Dimensions Gold Collection kits, which I want to show you as well, the, my FFO and FFOs, uh, cross stitch uh, kits I've stitched already. They're finished and I want to show you them. But uh, this is some threads from Gold Petites. Sometimes they're from. Um, dimensions kit made in the United States and it's really uncomfortable to put it on another organizer so I used to make like this maybe I will change my system I don't know but for now I don't want to change anything so this is like that and let's start let's start I know I was talking so long <laughs> and you can't wait to see my cross stitch kits well I hope so because this is my favorite kind of videos when I see a stash. I love, I love, love to see stash because I'm shopaholic, but right now I don't wanna buy anything because when I look at my kids, I'm like, I really have enough. I don't have big house. So let me organize to 
That's why I put these boxes so I can show you my kids nicely. So this is woman with bouquet. Some kits I know which are out of print, which are still possible to buy. Maybe my latest information not uh, correct, but let me know in the comments. Number 7035274. This kit I bought from eBay. I don't think I open it, but I try not to open uh, my kits. Sometimes I want to, I do, but I prefer not to open. And this kit I bought in the very last moment. I don't know why, but I've seen many, many times this kit stitched and her skirt, her blouse. You can't, you can't, you can't judge right now on a preview. Always, remember always, preview on dimensions is not the same when, when you see the kit uh, in person. So this is my first kit. With put on pause, I want to print this. My second kit is Brilliant Butterfly Celebration. I'm not sure about that kit because it is out of print, but it's still available on eBay for good price. You can buy, you can buy it, uh, and I did bought it on eBay. This is the back of this kit, and as you can see, this is made in United States because of the organizer and I love this ribbon. I can't explain to you how much I like it because when you open it you have all the um, pleasure of uh, starting new kit and I love starting Dimensions kit like like anything else. I don't like to start Mirabilia to be honest because I have to collect everything. I have to organize my threads, I have to organize my fabric, I have to get uh, um, chart, I have to get beads, I have to buy, buy cranic, all that stuff and silks and everything. So when I have chance to start uh, Dimensions Kit, I'm so happy because I don't have to worry about anything. Sometimes I would replace the um, fabric and uh, you can see my picture of Dimensions Kit. I did replace fabric there and I'm happy I did because I don't like when um, when you have not full coverage uh, piece, I don't like to see AIDA, but sometimes I stitch on AIDA when it's not really important to replace it. And I like the Asian style of this picture. I hope I'll stitch one day. I'm not telling you I'll stitch it in a, all these kids. Maybe won't be even, even I won't. I would not be even touching two years because I have lots of things to stitch, and I had started lots of lots of uh, whips. I actually have to show you them as well. So that was my second kit. I'm not counting them. I don't want to know how many I have. I'm happy I have them. Believe me, every single one, especially from gold collection, I want to stitch. Next kit is winter impressions by Dimensions kit. It's uh, 35053 number of this kit. It's uh, this kit was made in China. You can see on organizer. Also, this circle means the organizer which made in China. But I think this kit was made in the United States as well because this kind of old design. You can see somewhere on a kit that will tell you year. After 2009, all the kits were made in uh, China. This is 2001, so this is a quite old design, and it was made in 2014. This is the date when it was made, and uh, where is my scissors? This is the date of the actual design was produced by Crafts back in. It was called Craft LLC. Yeah, but this kit was made in China, which is fine. I'm happy with both of them as long as I have them. Now they, they do reprints for Russia and I don't think I would uh, be buying even there my dream kits. Uh, they were reprinted. I'll buy them another time and um, because I don't have space. I really don't have space and also I doubt if I'll stitch everything and I don't want to invest more money in uh, cross-stitch anymore. I better will spend them on traveling core, will buy myself 
new pair of shoes or something. But anyway, I love this design. Uh, it was by Alan Mealy, and he he's famous for painting uh, his uh, pictures using red colors for the dresses. I might will have another kit made uh, by his uh, artwork. I'm not sure, but I can't remember what I have, honestly. But I love this design so much. There was many, many times stitch on the Russian floss tube. And uh, still, I still like it. I still love it. This is 16 count gray Aida. Again, I'm showing you all my kits are mixed. I did not uh, put them on order like winter, flowers or whatever. I don't have time, guys. Seriously, I don't. <laughs> I just send my guys for ice cream. Even I don't like when they eat ice cream, but <laughs> I need to record video. I don't want them here because they will come and disturb all the time. Anyway, this is next kit by Dimensions, Charming Waterway. Also, I've got it because I knew it was out of print. I'm not sure. I don't follow eBay <laughs> anymore because I'm scared I'll buy something there. But you can you can check. This kit wasn't that popular. I just did not want to take a risk and had a chance to get it and I got it. So design was by Victor Shveiko and he sound very Ukrainian to me <laughs> because his surname ends on K-O. Here you can see. And uh, this is obviously was made in China, first of all because of the number. This long number and uh, organizer over here. Also on the back, the 16 count grade. It's 2017. So it's actually quite a new design. It was produced, where is the year? 2013, so only four years, five years, because they stopped producing it last year, I think. 18, 13, yeah, five years. It was only five years for sale. I don't know why some people doesn't don't like that there are no people over here, and uh, I don't know, there are no people anywhere, but this is companion, I think this is companion piece uh, for European Bistro. Uh, this uh, kit uh, in my whips now and they will look amazing together just great I've seen it stitched on uh, YouTube in Russian floss tube and amazing result I like uh, the finish and everything that's why I've got it <laughs> because I, I was thinking it, it, it was not like my top 10 designs no but I wanted to have it my next kit is Twilight Bridge. This kit also I was thinking to buy or not to buy. It was not my top, not even top 20. <laughs> but then I like, I really wanted that kit so bad. And I wanted um, in a, I wanted, the, I, I, when I was buying this kit on a picture, it was showing, uh, kit was made in the United States, but they brought me kit made in China, which is okay. I first was very disappointed, but then I find out that um, kits made in China, uh, they have more threats. So if kits made in the United States, there are possibilities you will run out of some threats. Kits made in China, they, they don't do these mistakes anymore. They listen to stitchers and uh, so like, okay, fine. <laughs> But I like to organize my threads and organizer here, everything organized and very rare when they have three organizers. Here you can see. Also, this design was made in 2006. Here you can see the year and designed by Richard, Richard Burns. I don't know him yet, but I'll, every time I start stitching my Cross stitch kit. I will see the design, the not the designer, the original artwork. I will read about it and everything. I'm enjoying this so much. And this is 18 count ivory cotton Aida. 
beautiful kit and I love the sky over here again I love houses I don't really like this birds I don't know I might want to stitch them I will think but I love flowers I love the bridge I love the sky and everything everything I just don't like them it's okay my next kit okay it was opened probably was looking for some threads this is elegance of orient and I'm very very sure you can get this design still even oh, I can't remember but I think it's out of print now I have you have to double check this information because I don't know and I got this kit long long time ago here in Ukraine you can see here the price 812 grid now it's old price we don't have the prices anymore and she is gorgeous when she stitch or her dress your everything looks amazing it's a different story what you see now and what you see in person and i did not really like uh, asian designs before i don't know why i was buying them but i wanted to have them but now i love them and i'm happy i have them <laughs> especially after we came back from asia now uh, had great time and um, I've been in Asia many, many times before, but now we spent one month there and we've been in the same countries I've been before. I just look at Asia differently now because <laughs> I don't know why. They're very progressive, they're very different and I love service there. I think it's the best. Their service is just wow. So, let me not talk too much about other stuff. This design was by James Hemsworth and he's very very uh, um, popular in uh, Dimensions kits. They love to make uh, cross stitch kits after his artwork and number is 3795 design. I can't see which year. 95. So, so this is really old design. 1995 lots of bright threads i think i will replace uh, aida here and i understand now why this kit is open because i took fabric you see before i was very organized girl <laughs> i like when um, all my fabric stitch on the sides like i forgot how you call it <laughs> And I used to make it at, at home. My mother home, I have the machine for this, and you can see. Have to keep it for another design, but I prefer to stitch this kit on uh, linen. Okay, I won't be closing it. But it will look okay because it's 18 count and it's not um, as big. The, the holes won't be as big as you can think. You have to be <laughs> more active. <laughs> but it's so hot here. My next kit is Max in the Adirondacks. And this kit I also got long, long time ago in Ukraine. Number is 35088. Designed by Charles Vysotsky. Also very, very popular. Uh, artist uh, dimensions love to make designs after him and I think all his cats made after his artwork oh his his artwork is just amazing and I'm so happy we have a chance to stitch after him somehow lots of cross stitchers have this kit but not many of them stitch it and but everyone have it probably now and uh, another one mary the dressmaker i also have i'll show you later also i don't see people stitch so often but they all like to have it in their stash it's very weird i'm the same <laughs> ask me why i didn't stitch this kit because i have lots of others same like other people but you can see here lots of details lots of them 
and when you stitch you will see even more because sometimes you look at this you can see every single piece and I've heard it's not as easy to stitch as others because again here not so much background there is no sky usually dimensions love their sky and you stitch with half stitch and it uh, going very very fast here lots of different threads you have to change your thread you have to do lots of back stitch lots of cording lots of couching but at the end you will have an amazing amazing picture i should stitch it my husband he doesn't really like all the designs i have but he does love uh, dressmaker married des dressmaker and um, this one as well my next design is romantic floral also i did not really buy it because i thought i did not really buy it how i said <laughs> i did not want to buy it for a long time ago but I don't know why I decided one day I need to have it. Why I don't have it? As one lady asked me from YouTube, why don't you have it in your stash? You have big collection of dimensions kit. Why don't you have this one? It's very, very popular. And I like, yes, I should have it. And I couldn't wait when I get it. I heard this design not that difficult. It's only candle, which you have to really work. And there, Mm, couching, backstitch or something, I don't know, but the rest is not as difficult. And this is very popular kit, designed by Lena Liu. Lena Liu is one of my favorite designs, uh, designers, also she is uh, artist and uh, she has her plates and many many other different things, not only pictures. And uh, yeah, I think Dimensions have at least five designs by her artwork. Again, this kit is made in China, and I don't think it's, this is an old design that was made in 2006. Yes, you can buy it in uh, other kits, but I've got a kit from China, which is okay again. One day, I don't know when, but I will stitch it. Next design is uh, in her garden. And one time it was so popular on Russian floss tube. Still is, but back in days it was like, wow, people like to stitch this design. And uh, it was designed by Sandra Cook or Kak. I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong. Again, I have Chinese version. Her, her dress and flowers, it's a little bit mess, but here lots of, lots of couching. No, I think cording here, actually cording. But it's really beautiful, it's, it's amazing. There are other kits that look similar and people like to stitch them together as a companion piece. I definitely have all of them and I'm gonna stitch it one day as well. Next one is uh, Sacred Connection. Sacred Connection, I hope I read right. And this design was by Sally Smith. There is another one very, fam very um, similar. I also have a companion piece for this design and sometimes people won't realize what they see here. There is a cat and there is an eagle, looks like rocks. What else here? I don't know what else here. But anyway, just uh, interesting when you look at that you don't see all the details in the beginning and then you realize. I know that it's a little bit boring to stitch over here, but then you have so much going on. I'm not sure if you stitch the sky, because this is dark blue Aida. And this design is quite old, it's 1998, but I got it in Chinese version. 
Next kit is quite new, and um, honestly, I don't like like I don't like anything new from Dimensions. This was. Uh, the last design I like it from Dimensions, what they produced like lately, I think it was 2016, 2015, it was uh, new and I really like it. I love peonies, I love flowers, I love bouquets and I think it will look amazing with other my kids I've stitched already and I can't wait to start this design. Uh, I've seen it stitch a few times on Instagram and YouTube and uh, also I've heard it's not the easiest design to stitch but I think you will enjoy it you will enjoy because lots of bright colors it was designed by Robin Anderson artwork and it was only made in China obviously because it's 2015 okay next one <laughs> You guys probably have seen us stitch it once, but um, back in days uh, I did not uh, have a chance to get a kit and in our cross stitch stores they were selling charts and I used some dimension kits, some DMC threads, uh, I did not like the colors, but that's why I've got uh, original kit and I will be restitching it. It was one of my first designs I stitched from Dimensions. First was Eagle, and I think this was the second design I stitched, but I want to stitch it again eventually. Everyone <laughs> in Russia, in Ukraine, our Russian speaking ladies, they say it looks like a picture from the book and movie Gun with the Wind. And everyone thinking this is a house of Scarlett O'Hara somewhere in Georgia, <laughs> in Atlanta. <laughs> Wanted to go many, many times, but I only been in airport. Yeah, maybe one day I will go there. Who knows, right? They don't say uh, who was the original artist, but it was oh, 2013. No, why did I stop? No, 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 no. It's not 2013 because I stitched it earlier. Hmm. Oh yes, I have reprint. I have this was a reprint. Yes, because they first made this kit out of print. That this is was first reprint, and then it was like last year was second reprint. So that's why I won't tell you the um, original year when they produced this kit. Because I've stitched it like 2009 or 8, can't remember now. So, but my my friend is stitching now, and this she started from here, this bottom part. And it's always nice and uh, interesting to see how it goes. But I, rem I remember it was quite easy. I uh, I won't tell you now because. My experience now and before was different and my feelings and uh, everything else again was different. Maybe it was easy for me back in the days, maybe it's not as easy for me now. Sometimes it's like that. Yes, sometimes uh, before I thought it was difficult and I stitch now it's not as difficult. So every single time, every five years I change my mind. Also depends how much free time I have if I stitch long. I think it's difficult <laughs> if I have more time and it's fast I think it's easy another kit I also get I think it was reprinted as well and this is lost no more and I love this design I really love this design because first of all all this uh, calm color there is no much bright colors and just I love the picture I love the picture and also it's popular in Russia, in Ukraine, in all Russian speaking countries. And I've got here in Ukraine this kit number is 3867. Again, it was from reprint 2013, uh, but original kit was made long, long time ago. Yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful. Next one again, I've got it reprinted, reprinted version. 
My Little Sunshine. It was out of print. I wanted to buy it, but sometimes I would uh, think many times, why do I need it? I have lots of kids, so when I found out it was out of print, no more, <laughs> I quickly have to buy it. And uh, it's a beautiful kit. I heard people say it's really hard to stitch this door because it's boring. But you can stitch a little bit here, a little bit there. Not to do it at once. Also, again, I like to do back stitch as I go. It will be easier for you because I think here will be quite a lot back stitch because of the dress, flowers, and her head. Also the door. And I like the carpet here. It's beautiful, beautiful kit. Again, they don't say who it was after. Yeah. But here is 18 count ivory Aida. It will be fun to stitch. I have to be faster. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll have to. I, I definitely have to do the second part. My ladies' chateau. Again, it was out of print. I think a couple of years ago, and I've got it a long time before. Uh, also, some people saying it's from another book, or maybe from the same book. Uh, Gone with the wind. Uh, that's pretty. It's stitched on 14th count Aida, and I've heard it is not difficult uh, design to stitch. And you will enjoy. Uh, honestly speaking, if you see designs uh, on 14th count Aida, most of the time they are not difficult. Most of the time. Like I've stitched a couple of them now, and I would say it's true. It's true. Here you can see. Also, it's reprinted. I want. No, it's 1995. Sometimes they're, they write. Original year, or maybe I have original kit, not reprinted. Uh, uh, it's difficult to tell me right now. But uh, this sky is uh, not stitched, this cloud. So some people prefer to replace Aida. I would I would not be replacing. I would leave it like that. Next one, cheers, cheers, cheers. I like we all call it uh, cheers, but uh, it's uh, twilight's twilight's calm. And I, when we live in New York, I really want to go to Adirondacks to see these chairs where they were made. And my husband told me it's just mountains. There is nothing interesting there, and you have to drive like five, six hours because we usually will stop on the way to eat or something else. And it takes us longer than other people. Again, we are we are traveling with Daniel, and sometimes he wants some stuff on the way. And uh, you have to go there summertime because it's not as interesting in winter time. But <laughs> I still want to go there. I don't care if it's just mountains. Maybe sometimes you think it's mountains, it's not pretty, but then you go and you enjoy it. And I like this cabin here. And obviously chairs. I did not like this design in the beginning, even I've uh, seen it stitched. But then many, many people start buying it because of the chairs again, or because of the light. They like the reflection of the light on the trees. And also this house. They believe if you will stitch house, you will buy house. <laughs> so I don't know. I just one time decided I need this design so bad. Luckily I was in States and I could buy it uh, on eBay. And it is quite new design. I think it was after 2009. Let me check. Yeah, it's 2010. Dimensions, 2010. Next design is Paris Market, and I've heard this is not an easy design because uh, you have to change here colors quite often. Also, lots of lots of French notes. I think there are more than three hundred, which is not as much as on my Oriental Splendor, 
there was almost 900 French notes. But I think when you stitch all these flowers, you have to change your thread very often. Also the tree here, I think how this will be easier to stitch. But I've seen this kit stitch and uh, it's really 3D. It's like you are in there. Sometimes people add uh, more people here, but I don't know. I think it's just okay. And there is a guy here. I'll show you closer. I have to show you closer. I'll right? show you so far all the designs. Maybe you've seen them many times. Maybe it's not as interesting to see what I have, but I like this kind of videos. I would watch them not non-stop for hours and hours and hours. And also this design on 18 count Ada. Again, if you see designs on a smaller count, it means they're more complicated. But not always, not always. Another design I did not really want to buy in the beginning, but then when I had my collection, I I wanted this so bad because from our window where we live, we had exactly the same house, like really identical. And like, I need this kit so bad and I'm happy I got it. I've seen it stitch and I know it's not difficult design to stitch and uh, it calls uh, Lakeside, Lake, Lakeside Village. Some people say it looks like uh, in Italy, but could be in Spain, could be in other Mediterranean countries. Uh, I don't know, I, I like this design, but my preference was people and flowers. But now I like uh, this kind of designs. The problem is when you stitch landscapes, there is not much going on. When you stitch flowers, there will like I don't know, hundred flowers. You complete one flower, you feel you achieve something, or you complete it, or I don't know. But when you stitch landscape, you stitch, you stitch, you stitch, you stitch. You don't know what is <laughs> what is there, and it is, let's say it's tree or mountain or something or water. Yeah, but it's still pretty design and I'm very sure that sometimes maybe you'll get tired of flowers or people faces but when you have landscape it will be uh, you, you won't get tired from this kind of design they're like uh, classic and you can you can have them anywhere well it's my opinion Okay, next one. Okay, uh, I forgot to tell you, it's 16 count blue Aida. And original design, it, it's not that old. Uh, original design was 2011. Yeah, they did not reprint this because it was quite fresh and new. Okay, this is what I was talking before. Uh, Maggie, the dressmaker. I call her Mary. Sometimes I call her Mary. <laughs> Maggie. And let me show you her details. You can see all, all stuff over here. Some people like the lamp because it's vintage and pretty. Yeah, I've heard it's not as easy as other dimensions kids. But it's fun to stitch. It's really fun to stitch and it's fun to look at this design after lots of details. Nice. And this is American version. As you can see, I have to sort threads. I had it uh, in uh, Chinese version, but I sold that kit because I wanted them all made in United States, but <laughs> then I like I give up because it was so hard to find all of them made in the United States, and I just let it go. And now I don't care because uh, also some kids doesn't have enough threads, so better to have Chinese and to have some kids run out. And to, with me, it never happened that I was missing some threads, but lots of people complained before, especially before. Next kit, 
Oh, I forgot to tell you that Maggie probably is out of print. Not probably, but she is out of print. And a few years ago, my friend struggled to find it. And I remember I helped her. I found for her on eBay for a good price. After that, I, I did not follow. Because kids I have, I don't really care if they are out of print or not, because I do have them. This is Magnific Magnificent Wizard, and I think he is also out of print. I'm not sure, designed by Don Maitz. And this is quite old design, on a black Aida. Stitch on a black uh, 18 count Aida. And original design is 2002. 2002, but I have a uh, Chinese version. It's also pretty, and Daniel loves this design, because he likes, he asks me all the time, when are you gonna stitch my dragon? I said, I don't know. I'm not a big fan of dragon, dragons, and uh, but I like them. They're interesting, and I think that he will look uh, nice together with other designs similar to them. Next design is uh, Horses by Stream. You've seen it uh, in my videos. Uh, recently I was showing you my other design I finished and this will be companion piece for my other horses. Can't wait when I started. Sometimes I like, let me start now because I wanna frame both of them together. This is 13, 35, 174. Again, this is um, American version. But it was reprinted, I think, twice or three times now for Russia only. And uh, again, you can find them on eBay sometimes when they reprint for Russia. Price is going down on eBay and you can find for normal price. I wanted that kit for a while and... Uh, no, before I did not like that kit, but then I wanted... Um, I decided I need this kit because it will be companion piece. Then I liked that kit and then I found out it was out of print. In that moment I was so lucky to get on a good price uh, on eBay. And it was designed by Percy Clayton Wears. It's 2006 design. 18 count Aida. Another lady from Dimensions, a summer stroll. She will be companion piece in, for, in, in her garden. Also, another design I do have, but it's not here. I have some designs I bought uh, in Russia, but they're now with my friend. I have to go to Moscow to get the uh, whole luggage. Maybe there will be two of my cross stitch kits because I didn't want to pay delivery to Ukraine and sometimes they delay it and sometimes it can be missed. So anyway, I sold some kits I have when they were out of print, I sold them because I knew the reprint in Russia will be and I wanted to make some money. Again, uh, this design by James Himsworth, I told you he's very popular uh, dimensions. I like to use him to use his artwork for cross stitch charts and look at the details. Here are lots of roses, gorgeous dress. Some people don't like uh, skin dimensions, make uh, really like pink, like salmon color. And when she stitched, she is more red than on preview. I like her umbrella and oh, <laughs> her basket with roses. It's such a pretty design. Super pretty. It's perfect for, I think, for the bedroom. It will be great for a young girl to have this picture. And I think it's out of print and it was reprinted. It's stitched on 18 count Aida. As I remember, yes, it is 18 count Aida, and um, original design was 1998. Yes, it's quite old design, also super popular on Russian floss tube, and I think will be always uh, popular because this is classic. Another design is Sweet Memories. 
I know it's out of print, not sure if they reprint it, I can't really follow everything and can't remember everything, but uh, also I've got this design when it was almost out of print. And um, it's stitched on 18 count Aida, uh, designed by Terry Conce Redlin. Yes, Redlin. Oh, this is 16 count uh, dove gray Aida. By the way, 16 count uh, dove gray Aida. The color is very difficult to replace, but maybe now you can have all the colors. Now they die leaning like crazy and everything impossible possible. I'm very sure about that. Another winter design by Alan Melis. You remember I show you just now another his uh, design in the oval one. This is his work as well, after his work as well, another red dress. There are other designs, I think Dimensions have one more with a red uh, dress. And it's called Grush's Era. And uh, here is, this is not big design, it's, it's medium, I would say, not as big as others. So I've seen it in our cross stitch store, local cross stitch store. 16 count dove gray Aida. I have fabric inside, just here. Okay. So I have everything, everything here. And it will be my last design I will show you today because I'm a little bit tired and I think you will be tired as well to see all the kids. I hope uh, I help you to find your favorite designs. Well, maybe you do have some of them. Let me know. Uh, I would uh, love to receive your comments and tell me which one do you like and uh, maybe something new you found and you would fall in love. I'll be very happy because I was exactly like you. When I see some people showing their stash, I like I have to buy, and I like oh. <laughs> I wish I did not see that video, but same time I was happy I've seen that video because my collection quite big and um, I'm very proud to have this collection. And uh, I will be even more proud when I stitch them all. <laughs> but it's all for now. I might well record another video tonight. I will see. I have to be very active these days because we are traveling. I have to go to Kyiv. I have to go to south of Ukraine and then we have to travel overseas. So I have very limited time now to show what I have at home. Then I will be making other video when I don't have to be here. Let's say like showing you all the skits. I can't carry with it, them with me. But thank you for watching me and I will see you soon. Bye bye. Guys, I want to show you the amount of cross stitch I have. I took lots of kits from this box because I will be showing you in a video right now. And I took some kits from this box as well and believe me they were full completely full because these boxes came from new york and uh, this is not all cross stitch stash i have because i have lots of mirabilia it's just dimensions and maybe very few other cross stitch kits patterns and whatever this is very very pretty kit i supposed to stitch last year but i might well stitch in this one and I bought another six, but they're in PDF file, so at least I don't need to store it in my house.